Travelers heading from Hong Kong to destinations in Japan were not deterred by the several earthquakes which struck various parts of the country yesterday, killing 48 people and causing widespread damage to property and infrastructure. Check encounters at the airport for flights departing to Japan were busy as some Hong Kongers could not avoid the trip. I'm not worried, I'll take the risk. I have business to do in Japan, said this man. A 7.6 magnitude tremor off the coast of Ishikawa Prefecture in western Japan yesterday damaged many buildings and triggered tsunami warnings. The waves were not that big but still ended up pushing a lot of debris inland and many structures by the coast were damaged. Several aftershocks of smaller magnitude have been felt in many places, sending residents scrambling to relief shelters. The severe damage to transport infrastructure is hampering rescue efforts and making access difficult. The military has dispatched 1,000 soldiers to disaster zones for assistance. The death toll is likely to rise in the coming days once rescue efforts gather pace. Japanese Prime Minister Fumio Kishida said widespread damage was reported from many areas on the western coast. But all tsunami warnings had been cancelled as of this morning, he added. Sachin Katwi, Cable News.